Okay, in this video I'm going to be making a guide on how to tell whether these Adidastra and Rescott trainers are real or fake. I'm just going to basically run through all the things I can see on the shoe. These are the real ones, the uh, satin ones, and these are the fake ones which are meant to be the marble ones but obviously aren't. So I guess I'll start with the sole. The sole is not bad on the fakes, generally it's pretty much the same kind of thing. I mean, these ones I got off eBay, I'm going to be returning, because they're obviously fake. They were advertised as new, the sole isn't, but the, actually, the actual detail on the sole is not that bad. Um, so yeah. From that, I'll have a look at the signature on the side. What you can see is, the real ones, the signature's much thinner, like the lines are much slimmer than they are on the fake ones. That's the first thing you might notice. Other people have said there's like glue and stuff on the inside here. I'm not sure, like, I mean, that doesn't seem to be a problem on the fake ones, but I mean, obviously you don't want them anyway, just because they're not real. The next thing is the labels. I mean, you can see like, the word Adidas is like pretty off point compared to like how it looks on the real ones. I'll try and find it here. font looks kind of different so yeah that's another thing uh, thirdly the wings as you can see like on the fake ones it's pretty much just flat whereas on the real ones it's much more puffy so that's another thing you can look out for uh, what next oh yeah the interior on the fake ones it's got like kind of sock lining material around here just the adidas logo on the inside whereas on the real ones it's leather and uh, the Jeremy Scott printed graphic on the inside of the whatever you call it um, oh yeah inside the tongue the fake ones are made in China and as you can see like the actual picture of Jeremy Scott on the inside He's kind of near the bottom of the label, and also like the way it's sewn on is pretty like pretty shit basically. Whereas on the real ones, I mean there is a picture of him there. It's sewn on in white, so it's hard to see, but the stitching's clean, and the picture of the guy's face is kind of much more in the middle. So, oh yeah, and also uh, it's kind of gone blurry, but they're made in Indonesia, so that's another thing. Okay. The tongue shape itself, on the fake ones, it's got like a, um, yeah, it kind of, sh it's much wider, it goes out to the side here, whereas on the real ones it's just a neater shape. What else? Uh, oh yeah, the box. Okay, so this is the box the fake ones came in. I mean, it looks pretty shit already. The top in the top and the bottom pieces, the blue is not even the same color. I don't know if that happens to all of them or just these. But yeah, and um, it says "Made in China" on the side of the box there. Whereas this is the box that the real ones came in. Made in Indonesia. And also, like, the box is just twice the size, pretty much. So yeah, the fake ones are just some I got off eBay, they look like they were real. I bought them, they obviously weren't, so I'm going to send them back. And uh, these ones I actually got off the Adidas website. Oh well, the receipt's somewhere else, but yeah, that's it. Um, I think that's pretty much the whole guide, to be honest. The music has been Miles Davis. Thank you, Miles. So yeah, don't get the fake ones if you can help.